Welcome to today's video where I'm going to show you five dividend stocks you could buy cheap right now to make some dividend income and trade for profit in today's market. Now, if you've been paying attention in 2022, it's been a very rough year for the stock market, securities, inflation, cost of living. And I'm sure if you're alive and you have a pulse, you felt it. Now, I've learned over the years that buying dividend stocks is a great way to produce pa truly passive income. And they're stocks that are much more reliable in the way they move across the chart. They're way less sporadic and all over the place than technology stocks who don't, that don't pay dividends. So let me show you five dividend stocks right now as of October 2022 that I view as pretty fair deals right now to buy, what prices they've been at, what prices they're at now, and what kind of dividend you could expect when you buy these securities. The first stock I'm going to tell you about is QYLD. It is a covered call ETF that pays monthly dividends. As of now, QYLD is paying approximately 14% annually, but how... My experience with QILD is you get paid basically 1% every month. Uh, so if you have $1,000 worth of QILD stock, you could expect to get about $10 a month. Right now, it's trading at $16 a share, and it's recently been as high as $21. I have, I'm a huge proponent of the cover call ETFs and the dividends that they pay out monthly. The next stock I'm going to tell you about is Procter & Gamble, ticker sign PG. This is a company that's been around forever. It's in most bath supplies and home supplies you buy, soaps, deodorants, toothpaste, all that kind of stuff. Right now, you can see this stock on sale for about $125 to $130. It's recently been as high as $165, and it's currently paying about a 3% dividend. This company, along with the rest of that I'm going to mention, are considered dividend aristocrats. They've paid and raised dividends for 25 or 50 years in a row. These are the type of stocks that you want to pay attention to, buy, accumulate, and trade, especially during inflationary and depression times like we're in right now. The next stock I'm going to tell you about is Walgreens, ticker WBA. This is a, this is a stock and a company that's probably down the corner from you right now. They pay they are, Their shares are currently $33 a piece. They've been as high as $54 recently. Walgreens pays a dividend yield of almost 6% right now. This is a company that's been around forever. I love buying and trading Walgreens and CVS, actually. They, they, they kind of move differently, but they're going to move similar, similarly and pay uh, good dividends. The fourth stock I'm going to tell you about today is 3M, ticker MMM. This is a company that's been around longer than I've been alive, longer than you've probably been alive. They've paid dividends forever. Right now, their stock is about $115, and it's recently been as high as $200. They pay about a 4% yield right now. And they, again, 3M is in most things, most uh, things that you'd find at Home Depot or Lowe's, a lot of uh, household stuff and utility-related stuff. 3M is uh, a part of it. And the last stock I'm going to tell you about today is a little bit of a different sector than the other ones I've told you. It is Federal Realty Trust Income, ticker FRT. This is a uh, REIT, a real estate investment trust. They basically, they, they own real estate, they buy real estate, they rent it out to businesses and individuals, they collect rent, and as a result of them collecting rent, they pay out dividends to their shareholders. This stock right now is about $93, and it's been as high as $135 recently. It pays just under a 5% yield, and if you go on... FRT's website, they show that they've been growing and gaining profits and revenues almost every single year for like the past 30 or 40 years. So today I just showed you five dividend stocks in October of 2022 that I think are on sale and good deals that you can buy that are income producing. They either pay monthly or quarterly dividends right to your account. And they're relatively cheap right now and prices that they compared to prices that they've been recently. Again, this is not financial advice. This is not me telling you that you that you absolutely have to do this. These are just stocks that I'm paying attention to, I'm watching, and I'm buying personally. And I think they could be a good addition to your stock strategy and your income strategy going forward. So to wrap it up, today's stocks were QILD, Procter & Gamble, Walgreens, 3M, and FRT. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in another video later.